And just like that, the 40 minute mark has passed. Welcome back to Tales of Vesperia. I'm your host, Mega Shadow Fist. I still got video games and second commentary, especially now considering I'm losing my voice. So, Leave it to me. these guys look pretty tough, I guess. So, if I sound a little. Well, actually, I. I don't think I sound too different, but I feel like my, you know, special voices I'd use for all the different characters will probably sound a little different than they normally do. That's alright. Oh, I used the Destructor, Destructor Pain Shot by accident again. Oh well. What are you gonna do? And this. And this. Oh, crap. I wasn't able to just cast my Arts Attack. Oh well. Arts Attack? Da -da -da? Arts Attack. You know... This is actually a completely random thought, but I just learned something t yesterday while I was typing out um, while I was typing out the description for my Metroid Zero, the first part of Metroid Zero Mission. For the longest time, I always thought that it was. Hold on. Oops, I didn't mean. I was hoping that the other guy was going to be near so he get caught in the destructive pain shot as well. I just. It took me until yesterday to learn that it was called Game Boy Advance, not Game Boy Advance, duh, with an D. I've always been, I've always called it Game Boy Advanced, not Game Boy Advance. It seems a little weird to call it Game Boy Advance, but uh, I guess I'm a little slow in that department, eh? Who knows? I don't know. More enemies. I'm gonna make you work. I'm gonna make you work. Okay. It's a good thing that I can hit you. Oops. Was that a text message? I think that was a text message. I can't freaking tell. No, that was an enemy. Ma an enemy made a sound that sounded like the vibration of my iPhone. Yeah, it's this stupid thing, whatever it is. Uh, black Rhino. Huh. Well, that's pretty easy to remember, considering it's a rhino and it's black, so... Or black, red, yellow, gray, and white, I suppose, but yeah. I wonder if we're gonna run into like red rhinos and blue rhinos. I'm pretty sure that there's gonna be color swaps eventually. This? No, this isn't scary. There were there were um, color swaps in Eternia, and there were co color swaps in uh, what should we call it? In Symphonia. Speaking hey, of Eternia, the let's play that I was watching just ended yesterday. Um, just ended yesterday, or at least at the time of recording this. By the time this goes up, which will this will probably go up on Monday of next week, um, probably um, <laughs> it, it definitely won't be yesterday. But if you're interested in checking it out, I'll leave uh, annotation right here. Okay. Anyway. Uh, by the way, is there like any leather helm? No. Ooh. Okay. This goes up. Okay, so this increases agility and defense. This increases defense. Oh no, what's P? What's the difference in P defense and M defense? Oh, probably like physical defense and magic magic defense. So I could go for a higher physical defense and more agility, or higher magic defense and higher physical defense. I think I'm gonna go with this one, honestly. That might be bad, but who knows? Um. Okay, nothing there. Ooh, that's right, we got the Knight Sword. It decreases it decreases my magic attack by 20. Uh no, I don't think that's worth it. Okay. Uh no, nothing new there. Ooh, more boots. And nothing it looks like ooh, yeah, that's right. Okay, so this increases one stat. This is by far the better thing to use. A leather whip. Why is this one so much more powerful than my other stuff, whereas leather armor sucks? Oh, man. Who knows? All right, all right. Oh man. All right, all right. Do I have? Do I? I I should probably let me check my um. Oh, they. I have them set to attack same enemy. Um, should I keep it that way or? I think same enemy should be fine for now. Um, I'll probably have them switch. I don't know. Anyway, who cares? It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you Because you've lived longer, right? <laughs> anyway, what do you have to say for yourself, buddy? Oops. I'm surprised it didn't count as an advantage encounter. <laughs> I'm surprised that it didn't. Oh well. I'm glad that it didn't, because we'd have repeat in the party, and although repeat is cool, I just find it to be a lot less useful than Rita, honestly. Oops. 
Honestly? Yeah, I beat you into next week. Next week? Honestly, I think that this is probably going to be like the main party that I'm going to uh, keep from now on, probably for the rest. Like, obviously, if we have anything to do, like, uh, like in Symphonia, they force you to like change your party to add a certain member into the party whenever you had to, whenever um, you had to like do a fight with the summoning spirit. But um, I don't remember them doing that in Eternia, like forcing like a per certain member into the party. Um, I don't know if this game is going to follow suite with, Symph with Symphonia, and, uh, so there's nothing here, there's just a bonus room. And, um, or follow suit, I should say, and, um, force me to have certain members of the party. They probably will be. I feel like they probably- Oh, that's Sorry annoying. I, I feel like probably the only required person in each party is probably going to be Yuri, so as long as I have him in the party, then everything should be fine. But I kind of want to have it so I have two distance characters and two- um, physical character, like two close range characters. And destructive pain shot? Oops. What is forward A? What did I have set for forward A? No. Do I not have a forward A attack? Let me see. Uh, let me go to arts. Forward. Oh, it's, oh, it's the same for back and forward. I see. But that still should have been destructive pain shot. I don't understand. <laughs> okay. Whatever. Instead of doing Dragon Up, or sometimes Arts can be really, <coughs> excuse me, finicky for whatever reason. Oh! Uh, no, this, yeah, this is a Monday series. So the, my next series should, won't be out just yet until tomorrow. Well, tomorrow when this comes out, but it'll be Tuesday of next week by the time this goes up. I mean, well, at the time of recording this, but am I even making any sense? I never make sense in my videos. Who cares? <laughs> I don't even know why I question, I don't even know why I question that anymore. Go ahead and finish you off, buddy. Okay. Yeah. Definitely. I I am definitely I am definitely noticing that Carol definitely blocks a lot faster than Yuri does. So Yuri has faster attack but slower block, whereas Carol has slower attack but faster block. Interesting. I guess that's important. It makes sense. Well, that's the reason why I got so destroyed in the last recording session with Yuri. It's because. Am I reading this, or... Oh, I'm reading this. Eck! <laughs> Papa! Mama! Everything's going to be okay! Can you tell me what happened? A scary old man brought me here! I changed voices. He said it was because Papa and Mama couldn't pay their taxes! Do you think that this is the kid from before? How horrible! All of those, all of these bones. Could the monster have done these? Done this? Papa, Mama, I want to go home. It's okay. Everything's okay now. What's your name? I really am losing my voice. <clears throat> Polly. Come on, Polly. Be a big boy. No more crying. You'll see your mom and dad soon. Okay. Oh, crap. Are you kidding me, game? Seriously? Leave it to me. How is that even... <sighs> this game does that sometimes. That really likes to pull your leg. If that's even the right figure of speech, I don't think that is. It really likes to mess with you when it comes to, um... Doing that. Like, sometimes we'll... There's no way you could win. You'll load a save or like do a cutscene and then BOOM! Bo monster fight! Which is kind of annoying, honestly. But it is what it is. Jeez, I really hate. Like, normally I prefer doing. Normally. Normally, I prefer. Um. Let me use my destructive pain shot. Oops, I didn't stun him. I guess he was blocking. Normally, I like reading. I prefer reading over. Or, normally, I prefer reading the. Okay, let's pause for a second and let my, um, thoughts come coherently. Normally, I prefer to read, have, I prefer to read the character's dialogue as opposed to just sitting there and being silent. But not today, because my, I'm losing my voice and I can't read each character's dialogue, so as a result, um, it's just not as fun. Like, I can't even do my proper Carol voice and my... Estelle voice isn't high enough, 
Raiden's voice is actually pretty easy to do, but... And honestly, it has not been from doing these characters' voices, because this came from while I was on vacation. I don't remember talking too much. Let's see if this is better than, uh... It's not? Oh, it must be Estelle's. Let's see. It lowers your agility, but it increases everything else. Honestly, I think that's a fair trade. I think. I don't know, I think I might be screwing myself over, but who knows. What do you have to say, buddy? Why do I always say that whenever I fight an enemy? What do you have to say, buddy? <laughs> that's not exactly, you know... That's not exactly cool or anything, it's just... I'm not even trying to be cool when I say that, I just... Oh, what do you know, a car is passing by, so I'm gonna sound a little funny as I edit that out. I have to edit out a lot of car sounds today for whatever reason. Which is kind of annoying, but it is what it is. I forgot that I'm in semi-automatic mode, so... If I press a button, I'm just gonna charge to the nearest enemy and just... You know, I'm not even hitting anything right now, just... Semi-automatic's kinda cool, but sometimes it can be a little annoying. I don't- I don't know if I want to switch to manual, though. Are there any- would you prefer- would you guys prefer- let me know in the comment section below, would you prefer semi-automatic or, uh, manual? It's locked, you can't go in. I prefer semi-automatic, semi but if I should switch to manual, let me know, or if you recommend it, I should say. This is probably just like a bonus hallway, or something, who knows. Yeah, honestly, I don't feel like fighting anybody right now. I just wanna... I mean, I do, but I don't. It's like... It's not really benefiting me that much, because I am a little... I think I'm a little overleveled for this area. Oh, come on! Are you kidding me? Oh, now we got an encounter link. Jeez. <laughs> That's annoying. I avoid enemies, and then I end up getting caught in an encounter link. <laughs> Jeez. Wait, does Destructo Pain Shot actually stun people, or does it, um... I need to check that out, because from what I understand, I think it stuns people, but I think it just I think it just weakens their defense. Or does it do both? Who knows? Who knows indeed? Uh, let's see, who should I switch to... Where am I? I should probably hit this guy first. Uh, I need to be mindful of my TP though, because I am I'm I am losing quite a bit of it. Okay, D destroying rock and you now, a dragon upper buddy. Oops. Uh, Holy power, come to me! First aid. Dragon upper buddy. When was the last time I jiggled my mouth? It's probably been a while. Oh. Now it's, now it's time to switch back to, like, normal attacks or something, because I am running relatively low on TP, and I don't feel like wasting an orange gel, honestly. Come on, Yuri, these guys aren't that hard, you should be doing better. Oh, he's running away, because I have him set to, like, 50%. Yay! Okay, I don't feel like fighting you, buddy. This way? I would very much prefer, this looks like the way that I'm supposed to go, I would very much prefer a save state, no, it's locked, you can't go in. Oh, it looks like I'm going to have to go the other way then. Is this going to turn like super puzzly or something? It feels like it to me. No, don't, no, I don't feel like fighting you, leave me alone. I've already beaten you before. <laughs> Seems like such a waste to fight them again, it's not like I'm grinding or anything. I should probably be getting as much experience as I can so that I can stay as far ahead. Uh, oh, encounter link. Oh, man. So that I can All stay right, as far ahead of uh, the curve as I can. That's not even the right. That's not. I don't even think that's the right phrase. As far ahead of the game as I can. I don't know. Whatever. Jeez, there are a lot of enemies. I feel like someone's gonna die. Honestly. You gonna attack? Okay. Destroying rock. Oops. I wanted to do destroying rock, but okay. Okay. That's it. Let's beat you now, buddy. It seems honestly, it seems like we should. I should uh, probably use an apple gel after this fight because um, we're all running pretty relatively low in t HP right now. Rather, I should say me and oh my god, Estella's getting her ass kicked. Okay. Oh crap. Okay, I'm just gonna use an apple gel. Oops, I have to wait for the cooldown time, unfortunately. Um, there we go. Now, oh, flickering blades burn. 
Okay, anyway, let's go ahead and finish you off, buddy. And I think that should be it. I think that should be it. Come on. There we go. 300 EXP. Obtain small key. That's what we need to get. That's what we needed. I would very much like a save station. I'm probably going to get barraged by enemies as soon as I leave this area, though. Oh, got to be careful. Got to be careful. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, dang it. Encounter link. Ugh. And there's a stupid black rhino. Those guys are kind of annoying because they take a lot of hits, even at my level. Oh, crap. Apple gel, please. Okay. Ugh, jeez. I just want I need to. I need to rest a little bit or something. Do I have a tent? I don't think I have a tent. I don't think I have a tent. Dang it. And I think I can only use it in field, field maps anyway, which is kind of annoying. I don't want to be underprepared for the next boss fight where I, I have, like, no health, which is kind of annoying. I don't want to be put in that position again, like I was with Gattuso. Nope. Oh. Someone used an apple gel on me. Thank you. Oh, let me use my... There we go. I need to recut. I need it to uh, heal myself. Or use my elements. Okay. Honestly, I feel like nice recovery smash is a lot more useful than nice age smash, but I don't know. I'm so tired. Ugh. I would very much prefer to go in here and go to like a save station or something. I would like a blue save station, but that's, I'm probably not going to get that in here. Who knows? Use a small key to open the door. The key broke. You can't use it anymore. Oh, okay. I was like, what? But I, I come. I was expecting that honestly to only be able to use the key once. Ugh. Yes, go ahead and use it, Estelle. You probably need it. Hey, Estelle, I have you set to strong enemies. I mean, they might be doing a bit of damage, but it's pro we're really low on health anyway, as it is, so... Yeah, I beat you in the next okay, there we go. Obtain small wolf key. Okay. So, probably not gonna fight these guys. Use that to go to the other door, I imagine. Right? Probably. I'd very much prefer, like, a master key or something, but oh! You use a small wolf key to open the door. Key broke, you can't use it anymore. Okay, there we go. Uh, I just... I know I'm avoiding enemies like the plague, but I'd really just... I'd really just want to find, like, a blue save station, or... At least, at the very least, just a regular save station. Shen. Oh, no. Please don't tell me. I don't want a boss fight yet! What do we have here? More delicious snacks for my pet, it seems. So you're a go. You've got some pretty disgusting hobbies. Hobbies? Oh, you must mean my basement. Only someone with my refined sensibilities could understand the pleasure I derive from such things. You're just like those senile old fools on the council. They bored me to death and never let me enjoy myself. It's the privilege of my exalted station to dispel such boredom with the help of the common people. You can't mean that's your only reason to do those things. Well, I suppose I should go and fetch Ribgoro. So many new toys, he had to put on quite a show, though you may not live long enough to see it. There's no point in searching for Ribgoro. We've already taken care of him. What did you say? Are you deaf? I said we've already taken care of him. You... what have you done to my pet? If you had put a bell on it or something, maybe you wouldn't have lost track of it. Ah, oh, well, with a bit more money, I'll soon be able to replace him. Rago, how can you say such things and still call yourself a servant of the Empire? What? You? But that's impossible! What do you intend to do? Someone, arrest these intruders! We'll have enemies all over the place if we don't hurry up and finish what we came to do. Hold it. What? Don't we need to create an emergency for the knights to respond to? It's still too soon. First, we need some evidence. We've got to find the Blastia that controls the weather. Okay, can I save? Game! Please let me save. 
I just want to save. I don't want to have to repeat all this all over again. Uh, just in case I end up getting in like a boss fight or something, I'm gonna just start using some apple gels on people, on everyone essentially. Uh, wait till make sure that everyone has at least a thousand. Um, probably I want to use a melange gel on myself because I want some more TP and one on Estelle as well. Okay. Um, any I I just did that just in case I ran into like a a boss or something. I wanna. Just in case, I don't, I don't know, I, you can never be too careful. Is this the Blastia we're looking for? Strim. Latos. together Blastia with different formulas. This formula could manipulate the weather, but how could they use them like this? It's just like at Emmied Hill. They don't have the slightest respect for what they're working with. This is just what we need for evidence. Rita, shouldn't you finish that later? <laughs> just a bit more. I just need to check a few more things. You can have Flynn give you a look at it after we're done. Let's get busy with our emergency. Let's just break something that won't be missed. Okay, or we could do that, Carol. Frickin' idiot. <laughs> happened here but allow us to offer our assistance Flynn there see <laughs> he's certainly enthusiastic what the heck Is that the dragon rider I really hope that there's a save after this long ass cutscene. Seriously. Ugh, what the hell? Who rides a monster like that? That was a dragon rider! Dragon rider? More like dragon freak hurting my blast you like that. Dragon freak! You know, Rita, that blast you wasn't even yours. Anyway, 
Why do you think someone would go around destroying Blastia? That's a good question. I'd like to sit down and pick that Dragon Rider's brain sometime. As if you could have a normal conversation with someone like that. Do you think you can go home by yourself? You're going to get, go get that bad Rago person, aren't you? Yeah, we want to hurry. It's okay, I can go home by myself. There's a, there's a good boy. Estelle, what's the matter? I still can't believe the Magistrate could do such terrible things. Sadly, it's pretty common. Haven't you already seen what the Empire is capable of several times on this trip already? While you guys are having a nice little... Wait, yeah. Nice little chat. Rago's escaping in a ship. Oh my god, it's a blue save station. Let's uh, do this. Let's look at this. The Dragon Rider rides again. I never thought we would meet the Dragon Rider in Rago's palace. That was a dragon? I've never seen a monster like that before. Yes. It had a very different feeling to it than any monster I'd ever seen. I wonder where it flew away to after that. I'll bet it has a hideout somewhere, but we don't have enough information to find it. Enough! Enough with that dragon freak! Just thinking about that jerk makes me furious! And I'm gonna completely overlook the save and not save. Just kidding, I'm not an idiot. Oh, actually, I kind of am, but not in this case. <laughs> anyway. Uh, well, I probably should have gone upstairs first, eh? Oh well. What? What the hell am I doing here? Here we go! Whoa! Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it! I'm not ready! Whoa! That was like, Super Saiyan? No, not really. Anyway. These are all Blastia cores! Why are there so many? And they're all just cores! I have no idea. We don't even have this many at the laboratory. Laboratory, thank you very much. Could this be connected to the core thief? Could be. But I thought the one behind everything was a huge guy with one eye. That doesn't fit Rego at all. Then he might not be the only one pulling the strings. I wonder if the core from the lower quarter is here someplace. Sorry, none of these are big enough. I knew it! These guys are with the Blood Alliance! They're one of the five master guilds! Okay. Piece of cake! Piece of cake, no problem. But, as I said, I already knew who the fourth- I think I said it last episode, but I sort of spoiled who the fourth boss is going to be because, um... While I was doing research for Gattusa, who is the third boss, um... I saw the fourth boss in the suggested videos on YouTube, so I know who it is, and I s unfortunately, so it's not gonna be like a big surprise to me. To the thief too? Just what is the magistrate up to? And it was on this setting, so I think we're gonna run into the boss very soon. Not oh, not to mention that we had a blue save station, so. Worm Rago running from a bunch of kids? One eyed giant. So you're the one getting people to bring you all these cores? Maybe I am. You're quick, and you got guts too. My arm's gonna feel that. Wish I had you in my guild. How flattering. But it's pushy guys like you I have to watch out for. Upsets the harmony of the guild, see? Nothing personal. Barbos, what are you waiting for? Dispose of these brats. I did all the work you paid me for. Besides, the knights will be here soon. Rather not have those guys following me around. Next time we meet, you kids won't be getting off so easy. Wait, he's still inside. Damn. Soggy, we'll leave the rest to you. Zoggy? What? Roger Craig Smith. You're the one from the castle. Looks like 
we're stuck with this guy. Is this shit blowing up? Honestly, boss fight. Honestly, Zagi's character seems a, seems to be a little bit over the top for me, honestly. <laughs> like, even for like, oh my god, he's actually doing a lot of damage. Jeez. Ah, oh, jeez, I gotta, I gotta make sure that... Okay, so, this might be one of those times where nice 8 smash is very important, because, oh my god. He still does a lot of damage. <laughs> so, I was right, and I'm still... I mean, so, Kratos was right in saying that I was going to get, still have quite a bit of a challenge, even after Gattuso. I was honest, I was expecting that, but hopefully he doesn't just completely own me like freaking Gattuso did. I freaking hated that fight. Oops. Ugh, I gotta make sure to use my, oh, he's an overlimit. Um, should I use overlimit too? Actually, let me back up. And use, uh, oh, wait for that. Wait for the cooldown time to go down. And I'm gonna use, uh, wait, is Estelle gonna use first aid? I don't wanna waste. Yeah, okay, good. I didn't wanna waste an apple gel, because that was my last one. Okay, dragon up. Oh, crap. Well, he destroyed me. Oh, now we have to wait. Like, oh, there we go, good. She chained that. Oh, crap. He's still kicking my ass. Well, it looks like I wasn't as overleveled as I thought I was. <laughs> oh well. Um, I should probably use my apple gel on... I'm a lot of apple gels and melange gels. What does a syrup bottle do? It prevents physical elements. Cures both physical and magical elements. Uh, life bottle. Oh! Looks like I might be screwed then. I mean, I still have life bottles, but... Oh, is he weak to water? Water type attacks? I probably should have, uh, you know, I'm just gonna, I probably should have uh, backed up and, okay, so first and foremost, over limit, destroy, destroying rock, destroying rock, oops, let's <laughs> just chain that on him, honestly, he's still not that hard, he's, he's giving me a run for my money, but he's not as hard as Gattuso was, honestly, but that's because I'm a little bit over, I'm still a little bit over leveled, I think, at least. Oh crap. Use a life bottle, Estelle, please. Please? Okay. There we go. Uh, I wonder how much health he has left. I'm not sure. Oh crap, crap. Oh crap, he does some decent damage. Alright, I'm gonna stay back and have Estelle use first aid, please. Okay, please use his first aid on me. Or he can just... Oh crap, he's in overlimit again. First aid. There we go. No, are you kidding me? Come on. Are you? Why? Come on. Me. There we go. Let me use a life bottle on Yuri. Oops. Life bottle. Oops. Come on. I did it again. Life bottle on Yuri. Sometimes my thumbstick can be a little slippery at times. Oops. Ugh. Oh well. Come on. So long as he stays away from Estelle, we should be good. So long as he stays away from our healer. He seems to be doing a pretty good job at just focusing on us, which is good. Oops. Time to use this. There we go. Need to get rid of that physical element. Is he dead? Yes, he is. Yeah, he wasn't that hard. Honestly. He did give me challenge though. A good fight. I, I retreated. <laughs> You're tough. Yes, tough. You're definitely tough. I certainly won't forget that, Yuri. I'm going to kill you, Yuri. I'm gonna carve you into little pieces. Don't move a muscle. <laughs> I was honestly hoping that we would take the ship for ourselves, but okay. What? It's sinking! Everyone into the water! <laughs> Is anyone 
one there. Yuri! Esteles! No! But... but... shut up and jump! They shouldn't have. They should not have survived that because the surface tension of the water after a certain height becomes like concrete. So after you jump from a certain height, it would feel it'd be like jumping off of a building onto concrete. So they should have died from crashing into the water and splattered. But okay, sure thing, game. I am, but Yuri. Huh? I'm all right. I'm freaking Yuri Lowell. Yoder or Yoder? What? You know him? Look, a boat! We're saved! Hey! Over here! It looks like everyone made it through unharmed. Master Yoder! Wait, I'll pull you out! Sodia, give me a hand! So it's Yoder. The port town, Capua Torum. Oh my god, this is so different from Nor. From uh, Nor Harbor. <laughs> I owe you my thanks. You saved my life. Hey, who is this guy? Um, well, you see. I've made arrangements at the inn. We can discuss things further there. You'll come, won't you? All right, a little freaked out. I thought you were done for when the ship sank with you still on it. Seriously, I was pretty worried there for a minute. I'm glad you made it. It sank faster than I thought it would. I was a little freaked out myself. You almost died and you were just a little freaked out? There's something wrong with you. <laughs> anyway, what do you have to say, lady? I've seen quite a few men row off to sea in a boat. None of them has been si ha them has been back since. <coughs> Excuse me. You like my old lady voice? I think I I like my old lady voice. Travelers Guild is it? Rago closed de closed down the Capua Nor port, and now we can't even run our liner service. Okay, sure thing, buddy. That's cool. Um. Oh, you saw you saw that texture pop in. That was a little funny. Um, let's see, is this the end? It looks like an end. No, that's Fortune's- Oh, this is Fortune Market's AQ HQ! Um, I wonder if we're gonna run into that lady with the glasses again. I still think she's gonna become part of our party slash team or whatever, but I don't know. Whatever the case may be, what do you have to say, buddy? Far off on this continent to the west is the den of our guilds. They call it Dongrest Visit Sometime. I'm not even sure if I pronounced that correctly, but I don't care. Um... I want to go to the inn, save, talk to uh, Flynn one last time, and then end off the recording session because it's been going on for quite some time. I've almost hit the 40 minute mark for this episode, which is usually like, I remember I said that I wanted to make like, it was uh, my recording sessions were going to be 20, 20, 30, but it's sort of become 20, 20, 40. <laughs> Anyway, that's what I'd like to know. It's nice to have fans, but this is ridiculous. It looked like he went down with the ship, though. Maybe that was the last of him. I don't know. Common sense just doesn't seem to apply to those kinds of people. Man, I really don't want to see him again. Well, even if we do, he'll be gunning for Yuri, not us. I've got nothing to do with this. We'll deal with that when the time comes. Okay, so honestly, is this the end? That's Torum Warehouse. Where is the frickin' Torum Inn? Of over here? Oh, that's the ship. Honestly, I think this is gonna be like our main ship, from what it seems. I hope that, from what it seems, it doesn't seem like we have any Rain-type characters, aka, you know, Rain from Symphonia, who's afraid of water for certain reasons, which I shan't mention, but, um... Because that would be a spoiler. 
Um, I'm running in circles. I need to find the end. Is this the end? No, I didn't go bother going up and seeing. No, it's just oh, I can enter. There's a sign on the other side of the glass. Shop open on first floor. Come check out our goods. Or our, as some people say. I always say R as an O-U-R and A-R-E the same for whatever reason. Oh, there's a whole section that Flynn is waiting at the end. Where's the freaking inn? <laughs> I don't freaking know. Is this the inn? You're just too stupid to insult sometimes, I tell you. Anyway, let's save over here. You know, so we don't have to repeat any of that nonsense all over again. I have nine hours of playing time so far, which means I'm almost one-fifth of the way finished with the game. At least that was the average, was 50 hours. Okay, so nothing here just yet. This is set up pretty much exactly the same. It's like a carbon copy of, uh... Carbon copy of, uh, the one at <laughs> Nor Harbor. You! Yes? Have we met somewhere? Convenient time for amnesia. I know somebody who can fix that for you. Amnesia? I'm terribly sorry, but this is the first time we've met. Are you crazy? Magistrate, your crimes are undeniable. These people have seen everything. As I've just been explaining, someone had assumed my identity and was trying to ruin my reputation. It was most upsetting. Liar! I saw those people you fed to the monsters with my own two eyes! Well, Sir Flynn, who are you to believe? These young ruffians or me, a member of the council? Flynn. It's settled then. I bid you all good day. <clears throat> who does that guy think he is? And who the hell is he? Settle down. This is... This is His Royal Highness Yoder, candidate for the Imperial Throne. Huh? <laughs> yeah, right, Estelle. Good one. <laughs> what? I'm only one of the candidates. It's true. With the passing of the previous Emperor, Master Yoder is a rightful heir to the throne. I have to say that Yoder's voice sounds familiar, and so does Rago's. I'm gonna or Rago's. I'm gonna need to check those guys out after this is over to see who they are. Really? Yes. An alleged Imperial heir captured by a so-called magistrate. That's interesting. I see. Then this incident means that I... A little too juicy for public consumption, huh? I... I just... It's got something to do with your decision to leave the castle, doesn't it? <sighs> do whatever you want. I've got no interest in an empire that just sits and does nothing while its people suffer in plain sight. Yuri. And what have you changed by turning your back on such an empire? We need just laws laid down by the government to ensure that people can live lives of stability and peace. Those same laws just let Rago walk out that door. Which is why you and I became knights, Yuri. To change things like that. If we couldn't make it happen by yelling about it from below. Then we said we'd gain honor and trust, and fix the Empire from within. Remember? So, in order to get ahead in life, I'm supposed to stand by while somebody feeds little kids to monsters? Is that it? You want me to look the other way when our people in the lower quarter are being bled dry by taxes? It's because I can't do those things that I quit being a knight. I know, but has anything changed because you quit? Ugh. <sighs> He has a point, Yuri. How is anything different than it was before you joined the Knights? Wait, I'm coming too! I've done it again. I only want for him to move on with his life. To quit sitting around. Flynn, I... My apologies for such an embarrassing scene. 
What do you intend to do next? Would it be all right if I go with him? Why? I feel like so much has changed during my travels with Yuri. The Empire, the world... I've changed as well. Lady Estelise. Understood. You there, young man. <laughs> Me? Tell Yuri to take good care of this young lady. Okay. Is it really all right? I would rather do the job myself, but I'm afraid my current duties won't allow it. And as long as you're with him, I can be certain you'll be safe. You believe in him, don't you? I do. If you guys are finished, can we get going? We'll lose him if we don't hurry. Okay. Oh. I thought the cutscene was over. knows how to get to me. I know better than anyone that nothing's changed. I guess I should look for clues about the Blastia Corps. Part it with everyone. Raven and getting information. The way he looks, Barbo should stick out like a sore thumb walking around in town. It'd sure help if anyone saw where he and his gang were headed. Come to think of it, I wonder what happened to Raven back in Rago's palace. I guess he panicked and ran when the Dragon Rider and the Knights showed up. Okay, that's cool and all, but I can't face him right now. I want to save. You know what? I you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go out to the. F oh, you sack of shit! How's it going, Raven? Hey, it's him. <laughs> hey there, long time no see. Isn't there something else you should be saying? Something else? Hmm, can't think of anything. Well, they say the deceived have better memories than the deceivers, don't they? I'm just terribly misunderstood, honest. You need to see a doctor for your tendency to unconsciously cause trouble to others. You might see if you, you might see if you can get that foul mouth of yours checked out too. Gotta come back for everything, huh? If you don't stop putzing around, the knights are gonna throw your back in jail. <coughs> Excuse me, throw you back in jail. Hmm, the knights are a bit too busy to bother with me. I saw a rough-looking guild group moving to the northwest not too long ago. The knights can't just turn a blind eye to them, can they? Rough-looking, you say? Was it the Blood Alliance? Beats me. By the way, what was your business back there? Nothing special. I was looking for an apath apathia. Apathia. What is an apathia? Supposed to look like a really strong core. Heard that it was there, but I guess I had the wrong information. I see. An apathia. Oh, Yuri! Hey, over here! Ugh, I'll get you, old man! Hmm. <laughs> Maybe I'd best be off now. Yep, the Am Am Amazonis has emerged. Wait, damn it! I'm gonna beat you senseless. <sighs> Where'd you let him? Why'd you let him get away? He said he's terribly misunderstood. What? What does that mean? He got away. I'll catch that bugger one of these days. You should leave him be. Going up against that kind of guy is just a waste of energy. You alright? Just let me take a little break. Sure, you can have a little one. Then we've got to go. Go? Go where? We need to follow the Blood Alliance to get back the lower quarters Blastia. Did you get a lead on where to go next? I heard that a shady group from a guild was headed to the northwest. It might be them. To the northwest of there. The only city I can think of in that direction would be one that is destroyed in an earthquake. What could they want to do in a place like that? Hmm, good question. And yet you still want to go. I'm just saying we should go and check it out. Reunite it with everyone. Okay, I want to save, I want to rest and save, destroyed by an earthquake. Hey Carol, do you know anything else about that city you said was destroyed in an earthquake? Just rumors. Supposedly it was some guild's headquarters about ten years ago. Which guild was that? Sorry, I can't help you there. I've never heard of an earthquake that destroyed an entire city. Well, Ospio is across the ocean. 
Maybe the information just never made it that far? Hmm, I wonder. Anywho, Lederhosen, I'm gonna go ahead and... Can I go in? Yes, I can. So, if Yuri can't do anything just by himself, and he can't do anything with the knights, why not just start a guild? You know, maybe like a guild named like Vesperia or something? Huh. Who knows? I was I was wandering through the forest and became lost in some old ruins. It was there I heard the unnatural howling of some frightful beast. That's cool. Honestly, I feel like my voice is starting to come back a little bit. The content of Tol Tolbis it's Tolbikia got Capitorm and Donghurst in it. And in Donghurst, there's the union that brings the guilds together. And you? There are many of us with the same profession in this world, but we're not all in the same guild. What I mean to say is I have nothing to do with the Blood Alliance. Okay. I got to talk to you, lady? Oh. Wh what a strange group of people. A dog and even a couple of kids. And they don't look like they're related either. As a gateway to the All of Tolbikia, Capitorum sees its fair share of interesting folks. A motley crew like theirs isn't too uncommon among all the guilds that pass through here. But I could swear that I've seen that young man somewhere before. You too, ma'am? To tell the truth, he looks familiar to me too. I wonder where I've seen his face. Oh, boy. <laughs> Your room is the last one down on the right. Have a pleasant day. Sure, thanks. Well, I guess that last recording session, I know that I'm starting to repeat voices, but I don't care. Is the wanted man really hiding in here? I'm sure. I thought I'd seen him somewhere before, and then I spotted the wanted poster. I immediately knew it was him. That room up ahead. Hmm, alright, you stand back. Yes, of course. Oh no. Hey, wake up! Hmm, what do you want? It's the middle of the night! Not too much milk on my cereal. No, it'll get soggy. I said, wake up, Carol. We have to get out of here. The wanted man has three friends with him. They've also got a dog, so be careful. An Imperial Knight won't be beaten by the likes of a common criminal. Oh, that must be Flynn. Estelis, kid, wake up, you two. All right, put your hands up and come quietly. Huh? They got away. What was that all about? It looks like somebody snitched on us. Snitched? You're too well known for your own good, Yuri. Isn't guild influence really strong in Torum? Maybe that knight is overcompensating for how imp impotent he must feel. Yuri, that knight was just trying to do his job. I'd appreciate it if you kept your insults to yourself. Ugh, I'm never going to be able to get a good night's sleep at this rate. Well, at least we got away without getting caught, right? Can we can be happy about that. Happy? This is annoying as hell. The next time we stay at an inn, you can sleep outside with a dog. Do, 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 do. Anyway. <laughs> We're suddenly back inside the inn. That's a little silly. But now I'm going to go ahead and save. And... 9 hours and 14 minutes of playtime. Anyway. If you like this video, this series of videos, please feel free to leave a like. If you thought it was cool, please feel free to subscribe and join the Elven Brotherhood today. Also, follow me on Twitter, twitter.com forward slash MegaShadowFist. I'll be sure to leave that in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is MegaShadowFist signing out. Bye!